What? What did you just say to me, Christmas tree? You're out of here tomorrow. Who are you? Beer drink shorty here. UFC 182 has come to pass. John Jones, John Jones, you whooped his ass. What? I don't even know. Shout out in the weeds. Rest in peace to you. You will forever be in our hearts. You will forever be in our hearts, broski. Shout out to the underground. Shout out Bloodstained Lane. Shout out Middle Easy. Is John Jones already the greatest of all time? What? Is John Jones the greatest of all time already? I can genuinely say to on the what? On this day, John Jones will go down as the greatest mixed martial artist of all time just for the fact that for one, he stepped into the UFC at the tender age of 19 years old, 27 and 0. He has one loss on his record now to Matt Hamill, but it wasn't really a loss because he was dominating him. Stepped into the UFC, into the elite, into the best of the best at the tender age of 19 years old at 27 and 0. Now he's the champion. Now he's defended his belt 18 times. How many times did Anderson Silva defend his belt? 14 times. John Bones Jones has not even hit his prime yet. If he has hit his prime, he's just right there. He is like four fights. He's doing the Rich Franklin era of uh, tear. John Jones is a fighter that I love to watch fight, 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 fight. He's a guy that truthfully tonight I wanted to see Lou. I thought that Daniel Cormier had everything that he needed to take out John Jones as far as the wrestling. But my thing is, in that fight, after a few attempts, and John Jones, beautiful, and truthfully, I can't even really say as far as technique, he's just a longer 205 dude. If he has a horrible sprawl, he has a decent sprawl just for the fact of how lengthy he is. The whole fight was dictated by John Jones's defense on not being taken down and pretty much it took Daniel Cormier out of his element, took away all confidence in John Jones's wrestling. John Jones! Daniel Cormier lost all, Daniel Cormier pretty much lost all confidence in his wrestling. That's the reason why we saw the fight that we saw tonight. That's the reason why we saw John Jones even take down Daniel Cormier is because like when you're so confident on that one thing that you try to do, you're basing the entire fight on that and then you try two times, you try three times and you don't get it. It throws you back. And that's exactly what happened to Daniel Cormier. Daniel Cormier is, is Junior DeSantos to Cain Velasquez. Daniel Cormier will beat anyone in the 205 weight class in the UFC other than John Bones Jones. Because the way it is, he take John Bones Jones takes people's souls. <laughs> Let's get stupid. Throw it out. Throw it out. Throw it out. Let's get up some facts. March 8th, 2009, John Jones was born. John Jones was born March 8th, 2009. March 27th, 2010, he bought his first car, which was a Dodge Charger, brand new off the lot, 1979. Four in the floor, of course, because it came, it's standard, four in the floor. He went to a car uh, dealership and raced the Mustang Mar- What? What am I doing? Damn. iPhone 8 Plus. iPhone 8- I'm on fucking Twitter. Damn, giving people free damn Twitter follows and shit. iPhone 8 Plus. This is my home screen, folks. If you if you want to know Beer Drink Shorty's home screen, this is my home screen. The Facebook, I, I, I very rarely touch on because I ain't I like I ain't, I don't give a fuck what y'all niggas done. I don't give a fuck with them people. I don't give a fuck what these people doing. They check on me more than I check on it. Damn like hey light up. Light up I don't give a fuck about what they no, 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 don't YouTube next the IG Instagram make sure you subscribe to me subscribe nigga damn you all YouTubed out follow me on Instagram beer drink shorty follow me on Twitter
at Mr. Famous Face, a nigga used to rap. Uh, buy apps from them. The Play Store. Check your voicemails. Check your email, nigga, because it could it could be money. You never know. Like it could be money. And then if you're taking pictures, I hope it's a fucking two chicks making out. John Bones Jones is indefinitely the greatest mixed martial artist of all time. Not already in comparison to the greatest mixed martial artist of all time. I have to put, of course, Fedor Emelianenko would have beat John Jones. Like I said, I coined the name Black Fedor in Daniel Cormier. I'm the first motherfucker to say that. Real talk. Fedor Emelianenko, as far as the greatest of all time, Anderson Silva, Fedor Emelianenko, then you have John Jones, and then who else would I put even in that light? Greatest of all time, shit. I put Igor Vovchanchin, Jose Aldo Jr. He'll go down as one of the greatest of all time, top five, definitely. Who is the actual number one greatest of all time? John Bones Jones will go down as the greatest mixed martial artist of all time. Mark my words. You don't even have to mark them if you don't want to because no one knows how to use a marker anymore. No one has a highlighter. No one has a pen or pencil. No one uses stencils. Everyone's all in the mental using their fucking... These things. Beer drink, shawty. Mixed martial arts content. Combat sports content is back on YouTube the right way. There's a lot of that shit cracking. Last year I didn't do as much because I was trying to build up my little Team Dame affiliate channel. Reviewing beer, reviewing foods, whatever, whatever it is, what ain't was gonna be. However, Beer Drink Shorty is back. Expect at least one video a week, combat sports oriented. Hop over to Who Are You Review YouTube channel, which is presented by yours truly, Beer Drink Shorty. I throw a burger at a batch. Y'all wanted it. Now y'all about to see it. Uh. Three quarters of a beer knocked out just like that. Rest in peace in the weeds. Beer drink shorty is back. Beer drink shorty. Beer drink shorty. Beer drink shorty. Beer drink shorty, nigger.